Alright Milo Flex, here's what I'm going to say about this video. Um, it's a great video. I don't think you can make a bad video. Um, I'm going to have to watch all of your videos, but I've watched like three or four. And dude, they're all works of art, man. You have got some talented filmmaking thing going on. I'm going to tell you that that white burst off your shirt, you know, as you open the window, um, was fantastic. And you know, this whole inside thing, um, you're out in the snow now, but, um, you know, and your hair sucks, thing. Dude, I, I'm going to have to take a picture of my hair. When I wake up in the morning, I think I sleep with like a pillow, you know, on my head. My hair is going straight up like a, uh, what the, uh, like a mohawk. But in any event, um, that's why I always have hat head. I have to stick a hat on my head. But, uh, no, man, and you are just such a, you, you are like the best character in your movies. You are just such a pleasant looking, um, interesting person. Now you're outside, and I'm interested in this park where you are, where the steps are. I've seen that in one of your other videos, I think the one where there wasn't any snow. Um, But yeah, no, you just look like somebody that people would want to be friends with, and you just act like somebody that people, it would be a joy, you know, to have you in, in, in their life, and to be like coming by for a little party or something. But um, yeah, also, you know, wanted to thank you, like several of the commenters. Um, it was just great to see the snow. I'm from the Midwest, and I live in Northern California now, and it's been really cold, but uh, it's been really cold, like in the 20s and the 30s, and um, but we don't get snow here, you know. And I loved that about the Midwest. Um, I I grew up in St. Louis, Missouri, and it was just so much fun those times when they'd start predicting the snow. In other words, here in Northern California, we can drive to where the snow is, Lake Tahoe and the Sierra. But that just in the same as the snow coming to where you are. And I just remember those really cool nights when you're wondering, is there going to be school tomorrow? Am I going to have to go to work tomorrow? Is it going to be so snowy? And they'd start out with, uh, you know, four to six inches. And then as the evening went on, they'd change it to eight to ten inches, you know, and then over a foot of snow. And then you're really starting to get excited. And, um, yeah, I remember when I was like in my teens and early 20s we had a lot of snow and people used to complain about it and gripe about it and I just I didn't love it either I had a Volkswagen and I remember one time I was trying to get out of my street and it was like two feet of snow and I just was driving as fast as I could and it just went up onto a snow drift and all the wheels were up off the ground and I couldn't go anywhere so the next year I, brought, I bought a Jeep, which has four-wheel drive, so I could drive around wherever I wanted. And I bought cross-country skis, and I'd just go to the uh, golf courses and parks and uh, cross-country ski when the snow came. And so that was fun, and I enjoyed that. And it was just a lot of fun to have a four-wheel drive vehicle. Um, you know, everybody get off work and people be creeping along. Um, not even knowing where the lanes are, you know what I mean? They couldn't see the lanes because the snow was coming down. They'd all just be creeping along. And I was a little more aggressive back in those days, and so I'd have it in four-wheel drive, and I'd just be blowing around people and driving faster than the speed limit. So anyhow, thanks for bringing back all those memories. And um, like I say, your videos are great, man. So thanks for putting another one up, and I can't wait for the next one. Namaste.